Hey guys, today just a very short video. I just want to finally solve an issue that I had for a while. And that is if you are running Kali Linux on VirtualBox like myself and you have upgraded recently to a newer version of VirtualBox and Kali Linux. So if you have run a sudo apt-get upgrade, then you probably experienced the same issue that the shared clipboard stopped working. Now I have experienced this issue several times over the past couple of months, actually since version 6.12 I think was the last version where it has worked for me and from then on out it was just going downhill and I actually went through this process a couple of times because I didn't want to put together a tutorial but now I finally did. So if you have the same issue I quickly walk you through the steps that are necessary to get the shared clipboard working again. So the issue here is two things actually, one is the VirtualBox extension pack and the other one is the uh, guest edition themselves on Kali Linux. Now this tutorial will also work if you run any other Debian based distribution, so you can also walk through that if you run Ubuntu or something like this, the steps should be similar. Uh, I'm using Kali Linux in uh, this example, but uh, let's get right to it. So. Gladly, we don't need to downgrade VirtualBox itself. I just have upgraded VirtualBox to the latest version 6.1.4, as you can see here. And I also show you this here. Uh, there it is. That's the latest version as of 24th of March 2020. And uh, as I said, we don't need to uh, downgrade the whole thing. We just need to downgrade the VirtualBox extension pack. Now you can go here to find all older versions of VirtualBox. So if you want to downgrade to a particular version, you just click in here and you see all the different files that you need. But I have provided you with a specific link in this article and I will put it in the description below as well. So to download the extension pack that we need, you just click on this link in the article or in the description and it downloads the VirtualBox um, extension pack. Yeah, and you just run this and it takes a second. It asks you in VirtualBox if you want to downgrade. Just click on OK. I already did that, so I'm not going to do it again. I can just click on it and show you that. Uh, so I'm running 6.1.2. That is what you get from the link if you download it. And you can see this is the version I have installed. Uh, I just closed it up for now. <coughs> and once you have that installed, just go ahead and start up Kali Linux. In case there is any problem while installing the VirtualBox extension pack, just make sure your virtual machine is shut down while you try it, otherwise it probably won't work. So I have the instructions here in uh, the article, which I will link in the description below and in the upper right corner of your screen. Um, I went ahead and I booted up my Kali where I want to downgrade this, so I'm gonna copy this um, syntax here. And I already downgraded it and it works for me as you can see. Um, and I just paste it there. That was somehow not working. I mean my password. Come on. Three incorrect attempts. Great. Let's try that one more time. Okay, that looks better. Uh, you can see that uh, da -da -da is not installed, so we don't have that installed. That's what exactly uh, what we want. And after that is done, you just go ahead and reboot your machine. The next thing you are going to do is you are going to cd into your downloads folder and then you download the specific VirtualBox uh, guest editions from version 6.1.2. You can just go ahead and copy the syntax again. I already have downloaded it, I just do it again. There we go, it downloads. Takes a couple of seconds and then the next thing we want to do is we want to sudo make their media ISO. I already did that as well. Then we do a sudo mount. Then make sure you are in your downloads folder. VirtualBox guest editions ISO to media forward slash uh, ISO tag O loop. Put it like this. Now it's mounted read only and then do sudo media iso vbox linux editions run. Let it run. I won't do that now in here. And then uh, the installer of the guest editions runs. You are probably you have to agree with yes that you want to install it. 
And uh, once you are done with this, go ahead and do sudo reboot now to reboot your machine one last time. Now if you try that, your VirtualBox um, shared clipboard will probably already work, at least it did for me. So I can just copy this. And I had mixed experiences, sometimes I have to like right click and copy and sometimes I have to hit Control C for it to work. So I don't know why that is, but uh, definitely after going through all of those steps it worked for me. Now there is one more additional step you can take to prevent this happening again in the future which is excluding the VirtualBox guest editions from the apt upgrade. Um, what that means is that the next time you will run sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade, you will run into the same issue because it will upgrade the VirtualBox guest editions to the newest version. So until VirtualBox has that fixed, I recommend you to exclude those packages that we just uninstalled from the upgrader. And I have the syntax right here, so I'm going to copy it again. And what you want to do is, you want to just paste it. And the command is sudo apt tag mark hold. And then you put the uh, the tools in there that you want to exclude. And when, when you hit enter, you can see I already have it on hold. And that is on hold. That means now when you run sudo apt update and apt upgrade, it will ignore those packages and will not upgrade them. Uh, if you want to reword this, uh, you can just do sudo apt mark unhold as it's written in the article. And that's about it. I hope it fixed your issue. Let me know in the comments below. Um, probably this is going to change again throughout newer releases of VirtualBox and Kali Linux. As of now, it works and it has been working in the last two months or so for me, exactly following this process. So please let me know in the comments below if it helped and also um, give the video a thumbs up if it was helpful to you. Subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, the usual stuff, leave a comment below for the YouTube algorithm. And I hope I got your virtual box up and running again and you can happily copy and paste from your host to your guest system. Thanks for watching guys and I hope to see you back in the next one. Bye.